Welcome to Revit MAB course. In this session, we will continue the modeling of the HVAC for ground floor. Here, I need to make another mechanical equipment. So, I will select this and make create similar to take the same properties and by the space you can rotate until it adjusted to the correct location. So, I will put here, you can buy also here to adjust and select here the in and here the out so the supply will be from here so this is wrong so we need to rotate the equipment 180 degree so I will select and use rotate option and make 180 degree so now it's okay we can select here create duct from this symbol and then make 350 by 250 so 350 here 350 by 250 okay and continue the ducting till here okay okay and then another branch 350 by 150 so I will change this to be 150 okay and take the branch from here like this try to not in snap in any line okay and then this here extend this little bit like this okay so I need to make the diffuser so you will select one diffuser from here to make create similar also to take the same properties and I will put one here and one here and also one here return so select the return and make create similar to detect the same elevation and same properties and the one also under the equipment so like this then the last the last uh, item is the flexible duct here and here okay and once it took the uh, system it will be blue okay because it's connected to the system okay let's see in the 3d the other room here I'm rotating by shift and the scroll to hold on shift and scroll okay okay go right here and also go like this you will find that the two rooms that we did is okay 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 I will do the fire dumper here duct accessory and I will put here and it will take also the same color and also in the in the last step when I finish all I will do the insulation okay don't do the insulation one by one make it overall when you finish the modeling make it, make it overall okay so we will continue the ducting here the equipment it's repeated steps repeated steps okay like this and then select the equipment the in here so you need to to rotate like this okay and then go out from here by 450 150 so we will go to 450 450 by 150 and go till here okay you can also we can use another way like this here to put rigid duct connection not flexible okay okay now we will do the air terminal here air terminal like this 3 4 50 then make the elevation 3 4 50 and put it in the same location of the center line of the duct like this uh -huh. okay there is no space to make the fitting okay we'll try again no space to make the fitting so you will select the duct and make it for example 3 9 okay 3 9 and then try again to put the diffuser at 3 4 50 okay and here put here and now it is okay we put the diffuser and we need to see in the 3d what happened so it is done like this okay it's okay okay and here the retired duct so we will make copy from here copy like this to the duct to the other room 
okay okay we have this room the same of this room so we can select this system we can select the whole system that we did with control and this diffuser also and make copy for the equipment to the same location okay and you can move them to adjust the location exactly mm -hmm. here you can select them again to just make small movement like this to adjust and also this to make move like this so this is the other room and also I prefer to check the 3d step by step to make sure that you are making modeling correct okay so we did the four rooms as we know as we see okay okay thank you very much